Drop a bomb, 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 bomb. Back, back, back with a vengeance. KG's back with an entrance. Big up to those in attendance. Who like it? Reds come together like Tetris. No rules, this one's reckless. KG, this one's crazy. You're too lucky. Bro, none can compare with the KG compare done. The better take over when he drops that. Bon, bon, Going on bon. reckless, trust it's on. It's that time when he drops that. Bon, bon, bon. I said drop a bomb, Dad. I'm back. I'm alive. I'm alive! <laughs> I'm back in his house. Yes! Come on! Back with a vengeance. Back, back, back with a vengeance. Big up to those in attendance. Hey, it's morning. Um, I went gym. Nah, listen, it feels good to be back in. I'm telling you right now, what a couple of days. Why did my wife get tonsillitis? Oh my god! Why did I have the flu? Oh my god! It was serious. Honestly, my daughter minimal parenting this week. Are you telling me the truth? I am, Uncle. Literally, but I'm back. Let's. I'm so happy. You, you know what I understand? You know, health is wealth. Mm. Feels. I feel sick. I don't That's anymore. I feel. I feel sick. No, I don't. <laughs> health is wealth. If you're feeling healthy today, I don't care what you believe in. Just thank someone in it. <laughs> if, if you believe in God, thank God. Whatever you believe in, whoever it is, bro, thank that person. Because <laughs> it's not, hey, when you have to lay down, boy, <laughs> that's when you really know about yourself, boy. Anyway, um, in that time lying down, I caught up with stuff. And I had some, hey, I had an epiphany. I had an epiphany. <laughs> now, I was sick, but I've had an epiphany. I'm totally flip flopping on Kobe Mainu. I don't want him to go to the Euros. <laughs> I don't want Kobe there. Now, you're like, what, KG? How can you say this? Gareth Southgate is rubbish. Don't need him. I don't need England failure near him. There's one thing already. United failure, you know, it is what it is. But we're not going to fail. We're turning it around. You see England failure? And then you know them ones when he says the tax of, how long has he been in the England team? You know, these boys keep letting us down. I don't want him to be in that bracket. Because what I learned about Gareth on the weekend, he's not doing anything. Let me make sure that. <laughs> and, uh, what I learned about Gareth weekend, he's trash. He is. He's not delivering nothing for England. Nothing at all. Absolute get him out. No, nope. waste of time. My man, do you know what's so mad about Gareth? Gareth is a chief, you know. I know Arteta must have messaged him and said, bro, it's a friendly. Be easy on the minutes. <laughs> 90 minutes. <laughs> what? 90 minutes. Nah, if I'm an Arsenal fan, furious. Do you know, I was watching that game, yeah? With because I'm I'm locked in. I'm bro, I'm watching the game, yeah, because I need Arsenal to do well. This, you know, obviously you look now. I've changed my mind, innit? I'm locked in. Yeah. I was looking at that saying, brother. <laughs> <laughs> 90 minutes you got to be kidding me no. <laughs> then then I wouldn't be surprised when he said bro then it said um Maguire injured I said bro everyone remove yourself from the squad remove yourself this guy's taking liberties I I'm nervous now. We actually need Kobe. Bro, he's had his international thing. Send him home like he sent home Greenwood and forward him. Send him home. <laughs> Send him home. I'm watching Jude Bellingham doing big tackles, taking riding challenges as if he's not got to stop Man City from winning the treble. 
That's what I was looking at. I said, wait, what is going on? I didn't like it. Uh, Gareth Southgate didn't understand what's at risk. You got Man City chasing down a double treble and you're giving these players these kind of minutes. Are you well? No. Nah. <laughs> Send Kobe home. <laughs> I need... <laughs> International game is full scrub players. Oh no, don't get twisted. Kobe's not a scrub. But Gareth, it's it's enough. You see what he looks like. You're very calm on the ball. I think you've seen enough. Those 15 minutes, next to next the next tournament, World Cup, leave him out, send it. I don't trust Gareth with this level of talent. That's what he. Let Conor Gallagher play nine. <laughs> hey, Conor Gallagher wasn't bad. Hey, <laughs> if you don't expect me to flip flop, something's wrong with you. <laughs> I was at home. I'm not even fully. I'm not even that. What do you call it? I haven't reached my full powers. I'm still in like. There's, you know what I mean. I have not reached my full powers. Do you know what I'm saying? I think I've got like four, tra three transformations to totally reckless. But um <laughs> some kind of street fire. But yeah, um it's important. We need England, man. England, yeah. Do you know there's some players that I didn't like? Consa was all right. But Gallagher surprised me. Gallagher I liked. I thought Gallagher was decent. And I thought, yeah, let him go. Consa and them and there can get <laughs> Yeah, where do you at? <laughs> Got more. Yeah, nah, 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 nah. Co nah, Kobe. Because you know what's going to happen, guys? I hate to say it. Tuesday? Tuesday? <laughs> Kobe? 90 minutes. I didn't think Gallagher was. Hey, guys, come on. Gallagher weren't terrible, man. I don't think Gallagher was bad. Honestly, I saw people hating on Gallagher, and I thought... He wasn't one of the worst players in it. I thought he did all right with Thingy. I thought it was all right. I thought, you know what? It's a good performance. What do you want from him? Gallagher's doo doo. I ain't going to lie. I thought he was all action. I thought he was good. What did he do? What did he do wrong? Done okay. That's it. Do you watch the same game? Because Jude was running the show. Gallagher was cleaning things up. He was about a lot of energy in the midfield. KG, would you take Gallagher? I wouldn't take Gallagher. Well, I wouldn't take Gallagher over Kobe. I just said that. Light check. Let me do the light check. It's true. I'm not going to change my opinion because you lot thought it's rubbish. I, I was watching the game and I thought, you know what? He's not doing bad. It was a decent little performance. A decent little cameo. I was really nervous though. You see when someone passed the ball short to Kobe? And I thought it was going to be... And then Pickford pulled off that good save because that's all the streets where they needed. When that ball was passed short to Kobe and they were running down on goal and Pickford saved it, I took a sigh of relief. Because, <laughs> you know, we don't need them mistakes on the international stage. Especially when we're trying to hype up our boy. KG wasn't feeling well, though. <laughs> KG, Gallagher just ran around. <laughs> The likes are not liking. Yes, karma. Anyway, Man United are moving like me. Man United said 50 million. 50 million. <laughs> Wait, KG looks in the mirror and says it uh, says the intro from C Boys. I used to call myself an ugly yeet, but I'm not ugly yeet. I'm a sexy yeet. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? Hey, Raj, you little waste man. Raj, wait, wait, hold on. Where is it? Raj, I ain't seen you since we mashed up Liverpool that day, bro. What happened, bro? Are you okay? Raj, are you okay? Are you okay, Raj? <laughs> man, like Rajesh. <laughs> bro, Raj, this guy, yeah, usually he's there. Can't wait to bet, bro. Hold that, bruv. And I can't wait for your team to crumble to pieces. I heard your new sporting director come from Bournemouth, fam. 
Oh my God! It could never be us, man from Bournemouth. You know, I watch, I watch, I'm um, drifty doing the news about Liverpool's new acquisition, fam. He looked depressed. <laughs> Ah, dead. <laughs> hey, look at the announcement video. <laughs> it could never be us. Oh, hey. <laughs> oh, when the Chelsea fans telling me Gallagher's rubbish. Boy. <laughs> Stop it. Gallagher's whack. Big up still. April 4th. We'll be there. Ultimate joke. Man United, sixth place. <laughs> Hold out your boy. Hey, all the Ghanaians. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Ghana. Ghana. Anybody here from Ghana? Uh, you thought we were just gonna was gonna miss that little friendly, yeah? No. <laughs> all the Ghanaians. Wake the fuck up. Okay, cool. Anyway, back to um Regis Scheduling. We have to talk about um, 50 million. That's how my club is moving right now. They said 50 million. And then what did they, what did, <laughs> hey, Atletico Madrid said, we're being ridiculous or something. <laughs> Atletico Madrid, how much did you sign? How much did you sign Yao Felix for? Because you want to talk about being ridiculous. I think that, I thought that was a crazy signing. Personally, I thought it was mad. Get it together. Get it together. Pay up or shut up. Again, wait, Gareth Southgate claims Luke Shaw is the best in the world. As he perhaps... Gareth Southgate's got some big problems, you know. How can I see that as breaking news? He's going to be the... Um, he's going to be right on the edge of the season. We know now to play seven matches in the Euros is very unlikely. Oh, Gareth. When we're moving on and thinking about better things, Gareth's just shouting shit. Uh. Oh, that's a big question for today as well. That my answer. I'm going to open the lines in a second. But yeah, we're saying 50 million for him. Man United are on the scout network as well. This, this is the one I saw. Wait, hold on. Um, boom. I don't know if you lot any of the scouts inside can tell me about this player he's the center back um where is he what's his name one second let me go and find it so earlier this morning um here you go Boca juniors man like aaron asalamino he's 18 years old so he's got a release clause at 17.2 million are you who knows is any watching brazilian football let me know about men like Aaron still. But yeah, we're looking at him. Harry Maguire's come out because he's got injury and stuff like that. I think, is there anything else that's going on? Oh, wait, it's even cheaper. Release calls are 15.8 million. Okay, I think I must have done euros last time I read it out. Uh, anything else going on? No, no. What else is there? There's this other news as well. They're asking, should we give Scott McTominay a new contract? <laughs> Let me offer the lines. Aaron he the lines are open again Scott McTominay new contract wait no I said who I said you said you were Southgate a couple of years back <laughs> nah there's no there's no evidence there's no evidence. <laughs> I would never say such a thing. Pin it. You keep that that waistcoated figgy. All right, where are we going to start with? Let me talk to a quick Arsenal fan and see how he's feeling about Gareth Southgate playing this guy for 90 minutes. Ah, <laughs> uh, 90 minutes, Southgate. Ew. <laughs> Southgate's a fraud, man. I, I hope he goes to United. <laughs> Hope he goes to United. I would like to see KG's dream. <laughs> Wait, what was going through your mind? Hey, when it got to when I didn't it got watch to... it. I didn't watch it. Don't ask me about that game. I didn't watch it. 
wait, wait. When do you, when do you realize there? Yeah? So when how when did you realize that you played ninety the full ninety? When did you find out? I I heard it. I heard it, and I was like, this guy's a fraud. <laughs> it's a friendly. Why is he? Why is he not trying out Kobe? Why is he not? Doing ah, this? bro. Ah, don't ask about Kobe, fam. Don't Did you guys get any minutes? I didn't. I don't know yeah, nothing played, about the game. Hey, generational minutes as well. Generational passes. Generational sideways passes as well. Sideway passes, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Generational ones. Don't get this. Nah. The guys. The guys next level. Do you see all the players? They were all happy. They was all excited, bro. There was like everyone was happy to play with him. Declan Rice, all these players. I, 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 I've, been, I've been listening to your content, yeah. You yeah. sounded stressed when you heard the links. <laughs> of what? Of Sake. Sake. You have the links. The links. Now the links. Imagine waking up here in your club. That's like taking a piss. That's April Fools. That's new. No one wants that. But talk to me. This is a big week for you lot. Are, we, are, are you lot doing it? Do you know what? I, I'm I'm looking at the Opta stats here. They've got us at 18%. And they've got Man City at 45% to win the league. And Liverpool are 35 So we are no... Even though we're at the top, we're all guy at the top, we're, we're, we're lowest ranked in the top three to win I the league. I see if you're going to do it this week and you're giving me Opta stats. I'm confused. I reckon... These stats are gonna flip on their head on the weekend. This is what you was doing. That was the setup. Yes, I respect it. <laughs> Big up yourself. <laughs> I respect it. That's the that's that's what I'm talking about. I right, big up more money, fam. Um, <laughs> There we go. I didn't believe that chase. I didn't believe that chase. That chase came. Nah, with nah, I know, I know, I know, I know. He didn't. You know what? Yeah, he weren't really. I'm gonna give them more time though. It's Monday. He's not in the right frame of mind yet. He's still waking his way into the week. So uh, I don't. I don't give that grace. You see, Arsenal, right? Arsenal yeah. like to do that. They like to play both sides, right? They also no, they say the stats. No. They create context. They say, but we're gonna win. But this is the reason why. If we don't win, I don't believe that, bro. If you must, if you just want to stand on business, stand on business. Back yes. to team. Believe, yes. as the guy said. Hey, he's speaking to you, bro. John, John Morgan, John Morgan. I love your accent, yeah? When you come on the mic, you always speak calm. I, I respect yes. what you've got to say. I've got time for you. But yes. my brother, your team are like... No, no, no. You're not going to You're not gonna shoot at me. <laughs> you're not going to shoot at him. Disrespect to my team. Why are sitting there? No, no, no. Dancing around. The, dancing, he's dancing around. No, 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 no. Because he's about to be disrespectful. He's about to be disrespectful. Hold on. Let's, let's have an African committee meeting in one second. Let's quickly have an African committee meeting. Hold on. Let's bring in number one Asna fan. Hold on. Where's the Nigerians inside? Hold on. I know parallels. Ghanaian, but I swear. Prem, I think he's Nigerian. Hello, Dr. Hey. Edgy <laughs> <laughs> You guys seem to to be forgetting something. He said, "He said what?" Prem, are you Nigerian? Of course. There you go. We be what you call it. We dealt with Ghana. We dealt with Ghana. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Oh yes. Yes. I understand. You guys are seeming to be welcome. You guys are seeming to forget something. You forgot Ghana was going to win. You know. Oh, yeah, you're pressed. You're Make pressed. me you're sweat. Make me cry. <laughs> Make me lose my breath. Make me hey. cry. Hey. <laughs> hey, hello, Ghana. You guys are seeming to forget. Hello. That Ghana also... Ghana also played in the All-African Tournament. And who did we beat, beat to get the gold? Ask yourself that question. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Why are you bringing up the past? Why are you bringing up We're living in the present. That's it. Why are you bringing up the past? We're living in the present. We're living in the now. And we beat you guys. We're living in the now. We flogged you, man. Also, also. I got more than I got time for you, though. Wait, wait, hold on. Let's ask Parallel. Because Parallel is very focused when he can break down the loss, he can break down what he went through mentally. Parallel, you always see things the right way. <laughs> <laughs> no. Really? Oh no. I did. Really? Parallel. He ran. He ran. 
Let's talk about Ghana. No one's got chest today. Ghana has more chance of winning stuff than Nigeria. There's nobody. Did it. What? You said what? Number, one. number two. All I can tell you guys did not win it. So this is a country. What are they winning? I'm not going to ask you a question. What are they winning? The win vaccine you took right now, but hey, the side effects are hitting right now. <laughs> the side effects are hitting right now. Please. Pass it more needed. <laughs> That's the vaccine of delusion. I'm not gonna lie. To you. I'll, 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 let, I'll let you guys live in the delusion. No, no, no. What, 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 you guys what delusion? What years. happened last Afcon? Are we gonna talk about Afcon? You guys just said I silence about the past. Silence. You guys just said. <laughs> okay, let's, let's, let's talk about. about. Just remove yourself. Just remove yourself. <laughs> Come on. All right, we should work that guys. Good vlogging. <laughs> nah, rushing a woman. Only acceptable. <laughs> <laughs> Only acceptable in this community. That's wicked. He collapsed. That's crazy. He got robbed. He got robbed. He got robbed. All right. Good morning. Anyway, let's talk, man. There's a lot of stuff to get into. Uh, I think Parallel's making a comeback. It's too late, bro. She was flogged. Um, talk to me, man. Where's your head at? This morning, uh, again, there's a... We're back into football, bro. Tuesday, and then the team starts playing again. Saturday, big game against Brentford. Talk to me. I, okay, so I just want to address Pev in the chat because I said something with Chess in the, a couple of days ago, right? Yes. Be ready. I said, all right, that we as Manchester United are challenging for the title next season. Huh? Us as Manchester United are challenging for the title next season. It is Ten Hag's third season. It is his third season in charge. The continuity of football that he wants us to play it must be in, in place now. We had so many injuries. We're not going to have this much injuries next season. So I fully expect us to be challenging for the title. Fully. KG, Clear. should we um should we laugh at this point? <laughs> Man, we're going to win the league. We're going to challenge you for the league. I don't hey. know. I don't know where you've... Wait. John Morgan. I said to him, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna tell the chat, I'm gonna tell the chat when he's next John on. Morgan. John Morgan. He, he just didn't, he didn't say it once. He didn't double down. He tripled down on this. Tripled Wait, I would, down. I would love to challenge, but John, where have you? What happened while I was away? Okay. What was going on? Because let, let, let me explain something. Though. Yeah. All right. So Man City is Man City, right? Man City is Man City. Agreed. Arsenal is Arsenal, all right? Yes. Arsenal. Hasn't Arsenal's been playing good football now since the since the since the new year since they came back from Dubai? They've been playing good football. So what yeah. we can understand from, from Arsenal is that even though they're at the tip top point since Wenger, they are only coming into the best um, type of football that we're playing. We haven't seen the best kind of football that we've played, but we've won a we've won a a, a, a Carabao Cup and we want we go into an FA Cup final, all right? We're going to a semi-final. We're going to an FA Cup um, um, final because we're definitely going to win Coventry. All right? So, what I'm saying is that I've seen this team pull off results that is far beyond us. For example, Yo, the result against Liverpool. You, you said right? this about Man City and Arsenal. What does this mean for Man United? What have we seen from Man United in two years for us to challenge we, the league next we, year? We've seen, we seen the win at Elaborate, the please, because we have a bet. We have a bet, John Morgan. Remember what uh, we said yeah. in the group chat. A Carabao, yeah, winning a Carabao yeah, okay. Cup and a potential FA Cup doesn't mean you're winning the league next year. No, but it gives you. It gives you. No, the, it doesn't. It doesn't. This is knockout okay, football. Okay. Yeah, this isn't league football. It's two okay. different things. Okay. Who okay. told so you that winning cups helps you win title? Uh, Who okay. told you that? So don't you think? Hey, no, it helps. Don't you think it's good to win? No, cups. no, no, no. A cup is a cup, but it's knockout football. This is league football uh, we're talking uh, about. Uh, let John Morgan drop games, his yeah. bars. Uh, and then we, can, game. we can cook him drop about talking, the bet that we have. You need let to, him drop his bars. Go on, finish, to, finish. But I'm not going to lie. What you said, let me let me paraphrase what you said so you hear I'm listening. You said to me, your reasons for why we're going to win the league is Man City is Man City. Arsenal is Arsenal. And then... And then... What they, are Man United? Man, what what are Man United? Am I allowed to say United is United? But what no. does those phrases mean, though? Okay, okay. What I'm trying to get at, right, the basis of my of my claim 
right? If you want this to be articulate and yes. professional. The basis for my claim is the continuity of a manager and a top quality manager. In oh. my opinion, we have a top quality manager. We've given Arteta, we as Man United hold on to the, to the Arteta project as a blueprint of how we can get and challenge for the league. All right. I have seen that within our own club, but I've seen that with a twist because I've seen I think Otet, um I think Tenag's a better manager than Oteta because I think the what um Tenag has done with Ajax, with Utrecht, with all those different uh, cop But he's not at Ajax, Ajax anymore. He's at Man United. What have, have, what have you wait, seen wait, on that pitch that Ten Hag has done for us to challenge next year? He's not at Ajax anymore. He's been at Man United for two years. A mean situation. Let him let him land. Because we've got just some land, fire right? to drop. So, right. So, for me, the, the, the project that we have, the blueprint is Arteta. Arteta is currently in his fifth season at, at, at Arsenal. Mm. And, he, and he bottled fourth the season before last season. He bottled fourth in his third season. Right? So, for me personally, I don't I see us challenging for the league because of the continuity of our manager. And for the fact that we have players. That's currently in his system for more than three years or going into three years. That's why I think that we can challenge for the league. All right. Well, listen, let, let Pav respond. Mark N, you're not in the house. I can't bring you in. He said he wants to back your point in here. Um, go on. You lot. Response. Uh, all, right. all right. All right, Pav, go, go, go. No, no, I'll let Yo-Yo talk. I said a couple of so, minutes. I'll let so Yo-Yo listen, so this is, what we're, this is what we've agreed on, yeah? So I've let John Morgan say this crackhead statement, yeah? And me and John Morgan have made a bet. Yes. If John Morgan is correct, he wants to go to Speaker's Corner in central London, KG. <laughs> Speaker's Corner! What is wrong with this guy? So if he wants to go to... And I have to take him there directly myself. And I said, I will do it. If people want to know, Speaker's Corner is where people who are of... who believe in their faith they go there and they debate each other. And basically, what I want to bring up to the delegation is if, if John Morgan is wrong, we yes. all have to come together to come up with a forfeit for John Morgan because this guy is coming up with a reckless statement. No, but then I don't want to bet against my team to not be successful. I don't want to be any part no, of this. We, but, if we, but if we go, but we comfortably finish top four next season, John Morgan's in trouble because I don't believe we're challenging for the league. All right, all right, cool. Uh, okay, question. Question. Yeah. Go ahead. Go on, go on, go on. Challenging, challenging for the league is relative, right? Because okay, you can be, let's establish the parameters right now so we don't yeah. have no funny business. Let's go. So, so Man United so must be in for the title challenge all the way up until the last three games next year. Don't come here saying, oh, we challenged up uh, up until, no, like, I don't know, with eight or ten six, games remaining. The no, last six, no, three games, no. we have to be there. Six I games. doubt that. I doubt that. Because last season, Arsenal lost the league in April already. And but then it's not a title the challenge, league. then, is it? A title challenge is you challenge till the end. Oh, wait, are you a title saying, challenge is you challenge till the that, end. Have, are you now saying that Arsenal did not challenge for the league last season? No, I never claimed that anyway. But the, but I the never claimed that Arsenal were going to win the league last year. That never come out of my mouth. Challenging. Unanimously, people right. said that they challenged. They challenge still. We know they challenge. Let's not lie. Yes, Let's, we know they challenge. I woke up this morning saying, oh my goodness, imagine... There's 10 games to go and Arsenal are still in the title race. And we're just, bro, that was a horrible, I, literally, I woke up this morning. I, I felt sick as well, bro. I was sick this morning. I woke up saying, look at, look at life. Arsenal are in the next round of the Champions League, yeah. And, they're in the title race, and we're just here doing up top four. <laughs> All right. So to, to, to elaborate, if we end up having a season similar to what City, Liverpool and Arsenal are having this season, then John Morgan, I will honour my bet and you'll yeah. be taken to Speaker's Corner like the past. Not just that, you, I said you must show me around. But you, you still haven't explained you. from these That's two right, seasons, sure, 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 from sure. these two seasons, what have you seen that makes you think we're going to challenge for a title next season? Because no one can okay. figure out what his style of play is. Oh, it's no hope, one hope and pray. That was my uh, only contribution. No, so I'll let no, you guys no, handle no. business. Okay, you don't put words in my mouth. No, I... Wait, so you see something? No, you, you said now open prey, right? I don't, I'm not yeah. I'm basing this on open prey. Last season, Liverpool couldn't get into the top four because of one player, of yeah. the Virgil van Dijk. They, yes. And they had so many injuries. This season, with a brand new midfield, with a, with literally strikers that that is not good enough, in my opinion, they're there and they're about. 
All right. So for yeah. me, with our with our best center back in Lissandra Martinez, and with our players that's getting coming back, copy generational for national be, third season. I want to be this. I want to Rasmus Hoyland. Exactly. Yeah. Rasmus Hoyland coming is one of our better, better players this season, coming into much better form because he's getting older, much more IQ. You have um Rashford. Doing what Rashford does contributing to the game. Bruno Fernandes. Did he just say Rashford contributing? Rashford contributes, right, bro. Listen, I'll leave it, guys. Big up. <laughs> These lot never gonna agree, fam. All right, we gotta keep it moving. Uh, Mark, and I'll bring in a second. Um, I'm gonna bring in number one Arsenal fan. I'll speak to you in a second. Let me just bring back Dr. NHS because I think that was bang out of order what happened to her this morning on the stream. Dr. NHS, I just want to apologize to anyone that was involved in what happened to you earlier. I think um, you didn't deserve that. Um, again, as I said, I'm just coming back from a flu. Um, <laughs> more, more should have been done. <laughs> Is this gaslighting? <laughs> Hello? Hello? <laughs> Dr. NHS? Ah, she's not here. <laughs> I think Jess is probably looking at the patient. No, oh, it's low. And it, why do you always call with the worst like of phones? This girl's doing surgery right now. <laughs> See you later. No, we can't hear you, babes. <laughs> no, Dr. NHS has got the worst line. I see young mega mind chilling in the car. Um, Kenny Fan TV, you know what? Kennedy, let me just give you one minute because that's when the energy goes. All right, the floor's oh. yours. Yo, yo, KG, how, how's, how's everything going on? How, how, how's the gym workout, mate? Oh, uh, bro, I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting the shape is coming. I'm looking good. I'm not gonna it's lie. I, I'm not gonna lie. I, I just saw you. I just saw the. I just saw the best of enemies. You look absolutely great in shape. Come on. <laughs> nah, even the person in the gym was saying, "Hey, something's happening." You know, I said, "Come on, let me give you more time." Because you absolutely, you absolutely cool expressions. Ah, uh, you... brutal, brutal facts on Spurs. I spoke the truth. I spoke yeah, the truth. Spoke the truth. Spurs, the truth. Spurs we have, won. yes, gone. Yeah, Spurs have like Spurs have a good stadium and just expressions. Exactly. Just expressions. There is, there is, because I asked. Why do we allow Spurs in conversations? I ask 100%. that honestly. I does every, you know when you think Leicester, even Leicester talking to Man United fan is insane. Yeah, but hey. absolutely insane, bro. It's crazy, isn't it, KG? Like, you know <laughs> no. what I was. You know what, KG? You know what, KG? I was I was just happy to see. I was just happy to see a uh, Kobe Manu for for like twenty minutes. He made some. He 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 made some good. He he did absolutely some 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 basic passes. I mean, yes. I mean that's what I mean. I mean that's what he he absolutely. No, but they're generational. They're generational basic passes, though. You have to understand. He understood where the players were, made the little move and stuff. He's he's yeah, decent. he did. He did. When when basically Kobe Menu came in, the the England midfield were in were in absolute control. Gallagher was was was, was damn awful. I'm glad that Southgate substituted him off. So I'm glad. I, I'm absolutely glad he actually came on, and uh, I, I, I was I was kind of happy with him, you know. Nah, nah, stop it, guys. Stop it, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> and guys, 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 guys. Guys, I, guys, I want you to, I, guys. Let's not put unnecessary so much of uh, so much of hate of hate on Ten Hag, yeah. Let him do his thing. Let's not expect any title challenge. Yeah, give him give him two years. We will be there. Okay. Hey, Kennedy, Come on. You're my favorite oh. person, you know. Because how does it happen, bro? <laughs> Every week we charge you up. <laughs> you guys are violating violating me man. these days. Violation. Oh, violation. Oh, oh, out of order. Out of order, man. <laughs> <laughs> He said, connect to Charger. Hey, I need, hey, Justin Kennedy. Hey, yo, yo, I need the Charger dying sound. I need that. I need that. I need that phone dying sound. Kennedy, every week. 
<laughs> I, what's a D? You can, you can, you need to go to jail. Because why did you put the W in the Wiley thing? <laughs> you know you did. <laughs> nah, all you look at Joe. The Wiley thing. How can't you slap? All right, cool. <laughs> Ooh. Uh. Let's go. Yo. Yo. Good morning. Good morning, number one Arsenal fan. Listen, the future's in your hands this week. Um, Can you do it? I mean, I could... Look, I could come on here and I could be like... I could be like Flex. I could be like John Morgan. I could say we're going to beat City. But well, I'm not, I'm not going to do that because I'm not delusional. What? I'm not going to do that. Like, realistically... I think we'll probably draw. I don't okay. think we're going to win. I think we're going to draw. Yeah, I don't see us winning that game. Bro, if you don't win, if you draw, yeah, I don't want to hear chest. Like, if you, like, say if you win, I don't want to hear, listen, come outside, everyone sit down. You didn't believe yourself, bro. So no, I didn't. No, I'm, I'll probably still be shameless, but, like, I don't believe. <laughs> I don't believe. I respect I, I respect the thing that said you're gonna be shameless because the future's in you lot's hands, man. There's a lot of there's a lot of football coming again. How did you feel about seeing your one of your players play 90 minutes and he's probably gonna play 90 minutes on Tuesday? Yeah, it's not great, but I don't know why I just hate that Southgate guy. I hope I hope he goes to United. You know, imagine, yeah, imagine you guys are coming on here saying There you go, that's a loss. Okay, really good call. Um, six figures. Hi, six figures. What's going on? <laughs> these man, these man do it to themselves, man. Yeah, they do it to themselves, they bro. Themselves. I don't even know why they're doing that for. Like, how, how dare you? How dare you to do that? We haven't spoken about. <laughs> yeah, that's that could be a ban still. No, but um, let's quickly talk about what the club are saying as well. They're trying to say fifty million for Greenwood. Um. Then we heard our ex keeper saying that he will be wicked up um, up front with um, Vlajevic, Keza. I like what they're getting with this. I like how they're talking. There's well, a lot. Of teams I'm, I'm, I'm saying just take take whatever for him. Yeah. No, 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 no. Listen, bro. There's teams fighting, bro. Barcelona. We've already had sit down meetings. We've already had a, what do you call it? Atletico are interested. Juve are very interested. There's three teams right now fighting for a player. I don't, I, it's just diff, it's just difficult to speak on him because I think they they're fighting for him most likely because these teams are going through a lot right now. Juventus is going through a lot. The amount yeah. of, the amount of things they're dealing with from point deduction, they I think they're willing to take anything they can because a lot of their players are going to be going soon as well. Then Barca, they they they're reaching their pockets, yeah, and there's nothing in there but fluff. Do you know what I'm saying? So it's it's a bit nuts at the moment. Like <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. I'm not gonna lie to you, he's a bit nuts. I'm, I'm just saying Green would take if they want to fight for him, let them fight for him, bring him back and let them fight for him. Oh, you say what do you mean? Bring how bring, do you mean bring bring him back? when when he comes back in the summer, because he is. Yeah. Just let them fight for him and just whoever he's saying, put, he's saying, put the, he's saying a light preseason. Whoever no 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 like he's gotta go early, he's gotta go early, he's gotta go early. Because if he goes on a light preseason and we see him in the we see him with other players. No one's gonna let him go. I'm it's telling gonna, you now. If, if he goes preseason, no one's gonna be but, like, yeah. In my so. opinion, he can't come to preseason preseason because if he does one light nutmeg and top bins, people are gonna start acting stupid. Oh, <laughs> so Mark N? Mark N? Let him get to, let him get, <laughs> bro, let him do one move in preseason. Bro, and it's peak top bins once, and everyone's gonna be acting mad. Uh, no, 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 no. Do you know what? Yeah, if Searching wanted to be a snake, yeah, have him on the flight, just don't and don't announce nothing. <laughs> no, that's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> he will lose his job. That's crazy. You can't do that. I let this, you know, you see the little preseason highlights, you know, when they're kicking it into the bins and that, bro. It, it, listen, yeah. If the, he's gonna have to dress like Kanye if he wants to get on the plane, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no yeah, way. There's no way. Not on the plane. He, he's, he's training at home in the back garden. Definitely, trust me. No, so but me. again, you already know because this situation is different now. 
I don't see him before. You know, he went in none of the Man United kit. He went in nothing. He was just training in that, what do you call it? Create yeah. player one. You know that um, fever create player kit? Yeah. Where you don't know who he's associated you know, with. What I really think they're going to start, what they're going to do to see how things are. Yeah, I, I think what they will do is they'll start maybe showing little videos in, of him signing kits and things like that. They're going to try, I think maybe they might try to ease him in and see how yeah. people look at it. But I think if either way, if, if these teams that are fighting for him rise up the money, then I don't see why they're just not going to say go. I don't think it's worth the problem anyways. Yeah, no, I'm, listen, I'm taking the money as soon as possible. I think it's a deal that they should try and do. Like, because we have to, you don't want an awkward situation when you get to the airport and then Ten Hag and Sancho and Greenwood are waiting for their bags. Mad, yeah, yeah, mad awkward on the concourse. About. That's what I'm talking about, yeah. <laughs> Hey, do you know who could that's looking at him thinking, hey bro, see sorry. Another yeah, guy's like, I'm, saying. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, there's like there's, there's due to be a few fights before man get through the yeah, the, yeah, 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 yeah. That, bro. It's like it's, it's, I mean, it's that's a awkward no that's an awkward way you know a li- the little the, the comedian in me wants to see that scene though just to see because you know Ten Hag's going to be on trying to not look at him in it <laughs> trying to you not look, look at him he, he ain't speaking to nobody <laughs> and you know and you know what it is as well if, if Rashford or any of them man try to speak to them as well they're getting a uh, yeah, they're they're not playing. Ten Hag is they're stubborn playing. he's a stubborn guy <laughs> You know, <laughs> he's a stubborn guy. Hey, six figures. That was fun, man. Big up, man. I enjoyed that cool, man. Uh, but we need to make these deals happen really fast. Um, let me do it now. Where we can, Prima, bring you back in a second. Let me see what Parallel is saying. Good morning, Mr. Continue. Charlie. Charlie. <laughs> hey, Charlie. I just know what Nigerians. <laughs> <laughs> Because <laughs> while I changed my mind not to flog, yeah, what happened though? I told you, Ghanaians can't talk to us, bro. You and know why one, you guys are lucky? That one was for the gel off title, bro. That one was for gel off. We said, <laughs> we're we said we're winning this game, we announced has the makes the best gel off. That was what they said. They agreed to it. And Ed now, Sheeran already declared the winner of gel off. You remember? <laughs> Who? He Ed Sheeran, what? he told you. <laughs> man too much salt in the nigerian jollof but anyway uh, move, move, move. when ed sheeran is the one that's making that's choosing who has the best jollof you only brought the wrong person to the market him get out. we need a neutral party a neutral party but no, you know man. even on that Taste i'm gonna be god <laughs> i'm good like even like with what you said at the beginning of the show kobe yeah. Kobena. Kobena. Kwabena. Kwabs. Kwabs. From Ghana. What in Kwasia Sem have you gone going to go and find? You've gone to go and play for this useless man. This useless man. <laughs> he could, no, wait, seriously, we need to bring him home. We need to bring him home right now. Im- imagine if he was playing. L- listen, yeah. I was saying Nigeria are lucky that none of our players choose to play for Ghana. Imagine if we had a Naki Williams, Cody Gakpo. Memphis to fight Pius the front three. Um, no, no, Kudus in the 10. No, we can't do it. Do you know why? Do you know why everyone is lucky? Because I've noticed with our nations, and that might be another show, everyone mm-hmm. asks why African nations or Jamaica, all these other countries don't do well in these cups. They don't look after their players. Fact. Fact. Liam Bailey, when he's saying he has to book his own pl- flights, yeah, I said, look at life. I said, <laughs> I said the worst thing about this situation here is I know the Nigerian FA are looking at it thinking, hey, we can't do comebacks. <laughs> <laughs> now nah, we are talking. Because they, you, you look at that situation, that's the reason why we won't have success in, in Africa in terms of look what we do with it. We don't play the players. The, the, there's no, the organization is terrible. And these are, these are big countries. Right. Right. Let's, let's, come on, man. Let's not, yeah, no, it's 100%. It's really bad. Just, it's really bad. When you talk about the African game, we talk about we want more respect and this, that, and the other, but we're not respecting ourselves on the world stage. When I was in Paris, when Leon was talking, I couldn't look at him and be like, oh, shame on Jamaica. This is how every African nation is operating. It stinks, bro. It stinks. And again, they, they're doing themselves a disservice because look how many players could come through. Look, I saw little Hendrick. Hendrick, little Brazilian kid, bro. I'm not saying that Brazil, like... The infrastructure is better in well, it is better in football, but yeah. even got the next kid, he's going Real Madrid, generational wealth for the family. 
big money coming into the country as well, actually helping the economies and stuff. Right? Yeah, man. Bro. Any year, yeah, yeah. let's not even get to that. Anyway, let's let's pop the time. Sorry, bro. The other thing I wanted to touch on was can I be a dangerous flip flopper? I know you say I'm normally sensible, flip-flop, and stuff. bro. Bro, flip flop. I believe I changed my mind on a controversial topic. I've changed my mind. If people are going to move along with the Greenwood thing, keep him. Hey! Wait, wait, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Keep him. My brother, welcome. Hey. Welcome to the team. <laughs> welcome. <laughs> And like I tell Joe Blackman, he already switched into Jamaica, bro. So you know what? Men niggas going to back him regardless. Wait a minute. I can't believe this morning. Parallel. Yeah, keep it. It's time we stand up to this press. Exactly. I know they're going to create all sorts of fuss and say, ah, oh, they're keeping him. Keep I want them to be angry. I want them to cry, scream and say, we're keeping him. And what? This is the hill you want the club to down. Yeah, we're keeping him in what? Scream, cry is like a child who doesn't want to go to bed. It's by all means you'll sleep. We're keeping him. Because all of it, like when you when I see these press releases with Greenwood's name on it, I just know what they're doing. It's like you're trying to incite something. So if it's incitement you want, incitement will give you. Yeah. Hundred percent. Wait. Take it. Wait, so keep keep you see, keep he's him. This is the just, but there's a lot of yeah. money that can be made. More money <laughs> making every win. win this is win the thing, title, bro. This is the press are making it in such a way that they're forcing the club to sell him for less. Because if we say, right, we want 50 million, they're like, 50 million, they're asking for ridiculous fees. The fans are going to say, yeah, just reduce it and get rid of him for 15. It's nonsense. We see what the press are doing. So my thing is, like, if you guys are trying to shoehorn the club into making decisions by the press, all right, we'll show you who's really tough at this thing. We're keeping him. Now what? Show some chess. This is what we're talking about. This is how United used to do things back in the day. KG people could say what they want. At the end of the day, back then, United used to make decisions and stand by it. They didn't care about the press. We sell the, the stories. Them have to write about us. We don't need to buy the papers. You know, bro. Facts. You understand? Facts. I'm over it now. It's like, as far as I'm concerned, if they turn around and show some chess and say, you know what? We're not buckling under this. I'd have respect for it. I say, listen, he's got a lot of rights to wrong. Like, you know what I mean? I'm, he's done a lot of shit. But as far as I'm concerned, I'm tired of our fans being manipulated. And I can see where they're going. United are asking for too much money. We're trying to get rid of the player and make sure he goes and build his life elsewhere. And still, look at what they print. Still, I'm sick of it. Wow. Bro, imagine fans listening to rival fans thinking about what they will think. Who cares what a rival fan think, bro? They are rival fan. They are the enemy. You know what I mean? Think about it. Back in the days in a in a, in a set of villages, you go and care about what next village say about one of the people in your village. No one cares. You know what I mean? This is football. We are we are against every other team in the Premier League. All the fans from all the other clubs in the Premier League, we are against them. Because we you, want to be better than one of them. So what you're saying right now is you lot have to back this guy, like in the like in in wherever you are on your platforms, you have to stand with my man. Bro, are you I used to do Mason Greenwood watch along. I stand there with my man for the longest while because you know what, bro? <laughs> Listen, right? And I'm being honest about this. Why should we capitulate to the media? They're not serving us, you know, bro. They're never That's serving us. Do they really care about us, bro? They're saying anything there for our good, for our benefit. The media want us to sell Greenwood for next to nothing. That benefiting United? No, bro. Right. They don't care what we benefit and all they want to see us is in chaos. And when fans realize that, then they will start to be fans of Manchester United again. The media are trying to give us Gareth. <laughs> <laughs> Gareth Southgate as well, bro. Come on, bro. <laughs> nah, nah. <laughs> nah. Listen, just because the media are moving mad, yeah, I don't know. Nah, you lot. On a serious note, I hear it's been a great sell. You lot have done a great sell, yeah? And my thing is, I don't want to... This is what I don't want to see. I don't want the situation to ever be in my hands. You see, like, if there's a light preseason and he's just joking about <laughs> doing <laughs> doing light rondos and that, I'm like, whoa, he's here. <laughs> I don't want to be on that one. I don't want to be on that one. i will rather move him on now. I don't trust myself. I listen. I don't trust myself. 
preseason energy. I don't trust myself. I rather True. him, bro, because I don't need to see. I don't need to, see, you know, <laughs> preseason time. Hey, I just want to ask one question, right? Yeah, and, I, and I want everybody to make it make sense, bro. Right? Just imagine getting rid of Greenwood for 50 million and yes. going to spend 70 plus on Olise. Tell me that that is an intelligent move. Tell me selling <laughs> Greenwood and going for Neto and paying more money for Neto than you sell Greenwood for. That is intelligent. Tell me, right, that you sell Greenwood you know and you're going to buy a Jeremy Pino for 60 he million. Ain't allegation tax, though, bro. He ain't got allegation. Allegation. Let me ask you a question, right? Oh, you think yeah. any of those clubs, those big clubs in Europe, the European giants, heavyweights, they're calling, they're calling the yeah. old lady like Juventus, Barcelona, want to game the number 10. Real Madrid thinking about buying him because it have the, the, the major scout looking at him for the last three months. Any of those clubs he go to, what, what, what they go on? Do you think they care about them allegations, bro? They care about the winning, the titles that they go and get. You know I'm I mean? back up that last point. Yeah. Should we forget? Because I hear the point that you're making. Selling, getting rid of, uh, getting rid of Greenwood to bring in Elise or Neto is insane. But you have to look at. You're not looking at it holistically. But can There's I make? Go ahead. Can I, can I make a piggyback off that one point? Me wanting him to go is less about the allegation. My, my thing is, as a young man, just go and concentrate. Oh no. Oh, Parallels just in Ghana. Just in Ghana. He just been Ghana. Yeah, but but you know what, KG? Like I understand. Hello, that. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah. Good good. Good. So Lucas Hernandez, yeah, at Bayern Munich did God knows what to his wife. Right? They still played him as a big club. Right? There's Benzema, we all know what Benzema did, right? <laughs> he still picked up a Ballon d'Or. Right. My thing, my my thing is move him on for the sake of his family that was my initial thing like for the yes. sake of his young family get get away from all of this nonsense Mental health but if the press are going to move like this and it's like they, they, there's just no but rest in sight like, behind bro, he's not even in the country look how the press are moving hold on prem said he wants to exactly there's, there's no, no continue KG. continue point Honestly. there's no there's bro he's not even in the country yet and the press are moving crazy so you can only imagine is then if, if we if we buckle now, we'll buckle forever. So my thing is like, all right, cool. Be the, be the energy. We're keeping it. Hundred <laughs> percent. I'm not gonna lie. Parallel, there's, there, there's a lot of backlash with that. You get it? Because like we obviously know everyone knows his story and everything. So him being in the club is gonna create more drama. Do you understand? And as fans, we don't like that. We don't need. All, I'm I'm with you, really. bro. But the the drama. My, my thing is, he's not in the club and it's still creating drama. So not really. We, we I, get... no, no, I trust me, parallel. The yeah, it's not the they same. The it's not the same. Bro, let that I... person lying there, KG. Benzema <laughs> never stopped playing for France, eh, bro. That person talking madness. Check <laughs> France teams that went to the World Cup no, and went to the Euros. No, Benzema and all of the teams. They left him out for a while, though. They left him out for a while. Only bought him no, back. That was like... only recently, bro. Benzema was in the team right as soon as his charges was whatever situation went on. The next no, Euros, he, he was there, bro. No, I'm saying, didn't he have a situation with the other player? Yeah, didn't he, he had, have, bro, he had si several different situations, bro. He had several situations, and he was still winning our World Cup with France before he went to court. I just say, and let's not forget Lucas Hernandez. Lucas Hernandez is one is very close to um, Greenwood. He 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 hurt his wife, unfortunately, and they kept him. And um, um, and my point is, is the way Bayern Munich handled that from a media perspective versus the way United have handled that is is my issue. It's like, hang on a minute. Stop being bullied. Stop being bullied. But may, maybe it might be from a place of emotion I'm speaking. I'm like, don't get me twisted. I hear everything you men have said. I understand. It's a whirlwind. But my thing is, at some point, we have to stand up to the whirlwind. At some point, even if it's not this Greenwood issue, it has to be another issue where we go against the press. It has to happen at some point. I we can't keep running. I don't think for this point, Look, though, Parallel. I don't think this what? This wait, wait a minute. I'm just reading up. Hold on. He went... 31 days. No, he got charged. <laughs> yes, on. yes, yes, yes. Bro. Uh, I, the Athletic would never allow this. <laughs> 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 you lot are bugging. You lot think we're the same as them. <laughs> no, hey. it's not about that, you know, bro. But at hey, the same hey. time, I understand the whole... Guys, all right. Imagine, we're talking about... Let's uh, let's put in the IC free tax as well, yeah? Because it's important. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> you tell him, charge. Oh, Bro. man said I can free. Not, not, hey, I'm stopping this conversation. Let me get rid of you. Are you not well? 
do you think Greek? We should have the. We can't. You know, we're not being realistic. We're not being realistic, bro. Do you see what happened when Onana dropped his keys and he wasn't playing the game? He just dropped his. He dropped his common car keys. <laughs> so now you lot are telling me, come on, man, come on. I don't think you understand. Some of you lot don't understand the size of Man United. I don't think we understand. We don't. We don't understand the size of this club. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, I'm going to do a poll, but it's silly because take the money and run. You lot need to understand, yeah? Man United is one of the biggest clubs, even as a brand, worldwide. And for people not to know that is, is weird to me. Like, we can't operate like other clubs. Then we got the whole, the English, I mean, the UK sensibilities of it all. Like, Barcelona can get away with that. It's just about football. They don't care, whatever, so uh, so heavy. Then you got um um horse. In or La Liga, they're not really caring about that. And it's not one of their own. Say it's an import, not really our problem. They can kind of move themselves away from it. In the UK. <laughs> nah. You heard how this, you heard how this club was... Britain was acting as if they've got no issues and everything's fine. Look how they're talking about the World Cup on the lead up to the World Cup. And all the journalists went. <laughs> they all went. They all went to Saudi, criticized it, stayed in lovely hotels. <laughs> Come on, man. You you lot know how this thing works. I'm sorry to say it. Um five million and five <laughs> and farty naughty shanty. What? Five million and Party naughty shanty. I don't even understand. KG, when Kendrick said my <laughs> MF the big free, it's just big me. It reminded me of you asking Flex and Owen, why don't they treat you like a celebrity on the Trinity party? Yeah, blood. Hey, listen, Kendrick. I listened to that song today still. Um, John Morgan and KG, the budget. <laughs> Again, careful parallel. You said a lot. <laughs> Of rights to the wrong. Yeah, Ash is definitely with you. Cantona showed violence beating up a fan. Kino blatantly showed violence breaking the player's egg. Yet they came good. We trust we can tr um we can trust Mason Greenwood. Um different, just different situations, man. This guy hasn't gotten before. Infrared, what? Well, go on, brother. What's going on? I saw you having your breakfast as well, fam. I was oh. going to bring you in like mid spoonage. <laughs> ah, with a cup as well. <laughs> You're having it, fam. I'm still having I'm still gassed off that Liverpool win. No, no, we need to, listen. We need to let the Liverpool tax die, fam. We can't be enjoying that Liverpool win now, bro. Man, I'm, enjoying it. Liverpool I'm enjoying it. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. No, but we got to move, fam. There's more right now. We're talking about top four, top five. Yeah, it's really top four. Top five feels shameless for me. So you know, I'm gonna have to apologize because I've come on the stream late, so I don't really know what's been said. Don't worry. <laughs> well, no, we said a lot of madness right, right now. Let me just ask you a quick question because there was a um, something on Twitter this morning. It just said, um, "What do you call it? Should we give McTominay a new contract?" Just gonna hear your thoughts on that one. No. Wicked. Thank you very much. Um, are you flip flopping on anything? Because I did a show called Flip Flop last week. Um, are you flip flopping on any of your opinions that you made in the past, bro? I'm not gonna lie. I might have to flip flop still. I might have to. <laughs> Talk to me. I've always <laughs> got time. God, God. You know what? I come in. Remember, I come in on my debut. Yes, it was a strong debut, fam. Talk to brother, me, brother. I might have to flip flop on that Ten Hag decision, you know. I might have to say Ten Hag in still. We got number one. <laughs> I, might have to it, blood. I might have to come with it because boy, I might have come in a little bit too strong. But you know what? I'm, let me tell you something, Mad KG. Yeah. Yeah. I remember what I said. I remember I said I'm not really all Ten Hag out. But yes. I want to see something that he wants to do. And I think in that Liverpool game, I saw what he wanted to do. This is it. Potential. And I said, you know what? That's the United that we should all be seeing every flipping week. 
regardless of who the opponent is, yeah, but especially when it's our ops, like our main ops, bro. Because yeah. this be cool, fam, yeah. Fam, no, KG, hear this, yeah. I've been having a big debate. Go on, talk to me. Yeah. We, we got a free horse title race, yeah. Yep. Mandy was saying to me, who would you prefer to win the league? Now, I confidently, without even questioning it, said Arsenal. That was good. I, I wasn't at that stage. Well done, you're better yeah. than me. I, preferred, I prefer Arsenal to win the league, yeah. But this is my yep. reason why like, people kind of like I'm mad, yeah. But yeah. I get to realize, bro, United fans in, in London and United fans in Manchester are two different sets of fans. Different, yeah, different youths. But man, them don't realize about Man United's legacy, fam. Like, I'm saying Arsenal need to win the Man United's legacy. Because the only reason why we got chat for these babies is yeah. because we can claim all these titles and Champions Leagues. But if Liverpool win it, we're back on 2020, bro. You see it? Right? If City win it, they've won a fourth in a row, which we've never done before. And oh, something you know, is warming up. I don't want nothing to explode in your background, but something sounds like it's getting... The washing machine. The washing machine is getting <laughs> <mixed. laughs> I was going to be like... I was like, are we going to tell like, we can't hear the figure. <laughs> uh, it's, the machine, it's the washing machine. You get me? It's, it, it's trying to do a madness, but it's calm. Yeah, the washing machine. And as you was building up the point, yeah, I was like, raw, so it's going to go. <laughs> go carry it, carry it. Brow, brow, brow. But yeah, man. <laughs> but I was just saying, Arsenal needs to win the league, innit? Because... 100%. We have to protect our legacy, man. Someone said it's that strong hot point, man. It's strong. <laughs> Wait, wait. Well, if you know, if you start shaking, just know what it is. And <laughs> again, again, if we're ripping up. <laughs> nah, nah, you know what you're saying. When they're shaking humans as well, the uh, washing machines, what? Nah, someone said the washing machine called Anthony. You lot need to have some respect for Anthony as a, as a talent, bro. Energy saving off. <laughs> Aye, let's talk to Young Mega Mind. Bro, Young Mega Mind is responding to the future. This Young Mega. Hello? What happened? Hey, Young Megas. Oh, well. It's not your day today, mate. Good eye. Kick from studio, mate. Get him out. <laughs> it's a just a minion. <laughs> Uh, where am I going? Let me have them. I had a debate already. Six figures have spoken, I think. Court star, GR, let's go. How long? I'm starving, you know. <laughs> um, hey, what's up, bro? Yeah, what's going on, Vegeta? How you doing, bro? Have you recovered from, um, obviously, us losing the great creator of Dragon Ball Z? Have you, are, you, are you good now? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've gone through my yeah. morning. My morning. Yeah. Look at morning. my picture now. Look at yeah. my picture now. I just came here for a good time, not a long time. Then I heard yeah. we're winning the league next next season. Look, look at my picture. I was confused. Uh, <laughs> now nah, you know what? Yeah, it's crazy. What um, John Morgan? Yeah, the problem is like I like where John Morgan's going with things. I respect it. John Morgan's saying we can compete, but it's kind of. It is a bit flawed, but I don't want to tell him that he's flawed because I like that energy. Like, I if I if I see enough from preseason, I will say we're going to win the league. I hear you. I listen to me. I hear you. But KG, I just I just rejoined the Ten Hag Defense League. I don't want to put this much pressure on my manager. I no, we, again. I, I know. I listen. I know you just rejoined here, yeah, but imagine, like, imagine. Yeah, because John Morgan was trying to paint a picture. He said, listen, centre-backs in, Omar in, Dan Ashworth in, young players in. Yeah? If we can stay fit, why can't? Why can't we? No, man. You know what the problem is? Last year, we had fit most of our players, most of them for the most part, and we did third. And then now, all of a sudden, out of the pink and blue, we must be challenging. Uh, guys, come on. Oh, but it's going to be new players, he's saying. And that's even worse, KG. These people still need to come in and, and, and actually learn how Ten Hag wants to play, get familiar with their teammates' game, and then you must, must put pressure on them. Come on, guys. Please. 
Hey, so what some people are saying, because there's been some um, Greenwood defenders, so the window closes. Yep. Greenwood's still here playing on the left-hand side. I'm not mad. Oh. I'm not mad about it. <laughs> I am not mad about it. Ganacho, Ganacho. Yeah. Hold, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ganacho. No. Ganacho on the right-hand side. I mean, on the left-hand side. Rasmus down the middle. A light yeah. Ivan Tony off the bench. Midfield, you got um you got Kobe six. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. got um, I don't know, like a light Paulinho or something in the mm -hmm. midfield as well. Yeah. yeah. And then that youngster from um where's that youngster from that we've been talking about? Uh that Jow, whatever. And then after you got you're bringing in Tossin as well from Fulham alongside another center back. <sighs> Are you this, 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 this is why I say United fans like pain. We love the pain. We love to live as this is Dragon Ball Z. We're gonna pull out the Dragon Balls, we're gonna call Simron, and we're gonna make a wish. And then reality slaps us, we're all depressed, and now we find ourselves rooting for us. You, you see the reality that hey, we find ourselves in those kind of players, though. <laughs> Dude, is this gonna I be feel... changes. Wait, what, hey, what are we doing? Are we having it? Is it is it is it fighting for the title? I don't think it's fighting for the title, but at least it's not. We're not going to be taken, you know, like little boys anymore. That's 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 as far as I think we'll be. Because right now, people are just thinking they can show up three points, light work. I think at least that will change. Not title. All right, interesting. Personally, <laughs> and then as yeah. and then as for us and Listen, uh, yeah, yeah, the little the one on the free. He's all. I'll take him on a free. The little the um the one from Thingy from Fulham on a free. Absolutely. Why wouldn't you take him? Well, you're gonna look down the Fulham now. I'll take him on the free. Uh, dude, you know what? If, it's not gonna be like oh, you spend a lot of money. Just take him. You know, you never know what will happen. A free fam. Of course, exactly. I would take him. Yeah, just give him a try. I mean, he can't do any worse than what we have right what now. You need, yeah, bring him in, fam. Are you? Just take so a we, chance. we need a Niger boy in the defense. Toss him for sure. Yeah, on the free. Bring him yeah. in. You never know. Just try it. You never know until you try. The worst thing you can do is not try and then be regretful. Just try. Um, what's that? He extended his contract. No, no, I think he's still Fulham and them man there. <laughs> yeah, them man there. Now he ain't extended his contract. I heard he's still um tossing and leecher. That's a bit that's a bit of pace and stuff. because I, I want to revolutionize the back four. So if I can get a player on the free, then I can still bring in another cold defender. Because you can't be in a situation when it's it's Johnny Evans and Lindelof to save the day, fam. Now, facts, and on top of that, KG, we still need to spend, for my, in my opinion, in the left back um, and a backup for Delo to challenge Delo. So if you can get, like, a free person to, to like, match up with Licha, it frees up funds for those other two positions, which, like you say, revolutionizes the back four, which is what's important, because yeah. we need to reinforce our back our back line at the moment. Absolutely. Listen, Vegeta, I, I, I'm glad that you tried to calm us down, but listen, if <laughs> it doesn't take me much to say we can win the league, fam. But I'm going to, I want this preseason. I want to be gassed on this preseason, I swear to you. And if Omar KG. starts moving mad, I'm saying KG, mad. KG, nothing wrong with it. That's why we call called reckless delegates. This if is you why. want to lose your mind, go ahead. I'm just saying. <laughs> but we're reckless. Do it. Lose your mind. Yeah, bro. Who you are. Come on. You better lose yourself in the music. The moment, the moment. Hold on. He wants to ask me a question. What's up? What's the question? KG, have you watched us? Have you actually watched him play, or have you seen him? Have you just seen some guy on Twitter say he's good? No, I've seen I've seen him in a few games. Still, we played against him. What we played against him a few times. He's played. He's been decent. Are you on sure? A free, on a free, you wouldn't take him. I mean, I haven't watched him, so I don't know. That's what I'm like, saying. I, I like, I've seen him play. We played against him a few times, and I think he hasn't been yeah. bad. He's been he's been solid. Well, I, he think... nice to... I mean, okay, let's contextualize. Let's conte contextualize it. Free. I mean, you guys said uh, to him again, right? And you want to say he has played against us, you crackhead. Even like, the season before, what are you talking about? And he had a little wristband. To say, I think he had a little thing on his wrist to sign a hand ribbon or whatever you want to call it. Wait, wait, you guys said uh, to him again, and you want to say what's that on a free? Said, uh. wait, 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 let me check. Let me actually verify if he even played against you guys. He has because I'm not sure about this on a free. From, is it Man City? What do you call it? 
Yeah, it doesn't matter if he's free or not. If he's a bad player, then he's a bad player. No tossing, no to McGinn. It's not the same as I'm not saying bring McGinn in, he's gonna revolutionize our midfield. Mm, he did play, he did play against you guys. He yeah, did. I know what I, I saw my own eyes, Elo. What's wrong with Elo? <laughs> But okay, are you gonna judge him off of the one or two games he's played against you guys this season, bro? My thing is, if you can bring in, he's he's a bit quick, he's mobile. All I need is a guy to stay fit and a partner next to um, what do you call it? Next to Leecher. This is what I'm talking about. Imagine you're doing live research. Move, get out of here, bro. When I when my research has been tested, fam. <laughs> Move and obviously Nigerian tax. I'm going to want to see. I'm like, raw, that's him. <laughs> when I got, when I got um, two twin, two twins in the family, tossing and toying, fam, move. <laughs> that's that's popular still. So I was excited already. <laughs> that's him being was fair. <laughs> um, is it time for me to get out? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, the Nigerian tax. I'm always going to be. As soon as I see a Nigerian name, I say, all right, let me see what you can do. Um, yo, Kurtz, what are you saying, bro? What's going I'm, on? I'm just here, fam. I'm just here, bro. These lot saying I can't be, I can't just want to bring in a, a, a player for free in that. Uh, with, with and he's my, from the and he's from the motherland as well. The tax on, is heavy, bro. innit? Tax is heavy, bro. <laughs> Let me live my life, bro. bro if, if we he, could, if we could, bro, if we could yeah. ever bring in a Jamaican, I'd move mad. Come on, this is what I'm saying. I'd love to bring a Jamaican in. You know, and you know he's not getting on international That's football. That's the thing, man. The That's what football right now. The way things are looking right now for Jamaica, it's looking mad on the international stage still. I don't know if you watched the Leon Bailey con the Leon Bailey interview. I, still. It's, it's, I can we can we move from that one? That one's a bit that one's a bit emotional still. I'm that not gonna one. lie. Me and my hey, dad had a long conversation about that one. Hey, that one was a deeper one still, because when you go book your the flights. The, the expose, the expose. He said, "Players just running." Back. I was. I, this is how my day. This is players. how my day was. Man's bringing their own bibs. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. Hey, Tom I was Robin. like, hey, this is how my day was." Yeah. <laughs> oh no! I, I can we talk about my night, please? Hey, hey, he said anyone can be even Kenyero fam. They said anyone can be the medical team. Just run on the pitch and just start talking to me. <laughs> One <laughs> light plaster. Who said if any fan can tell even Kenyero bro? Run on the pitch and just start doing medical work for no, nah, no. Nah. Oh my god. <laughs> nah, your hey, your your situation's shambolic, bro. I can't even back the thing right now because it's not looking good. We are not beating us. <laughs> I know we can still beat you though. Don't get it twisted. Bobby D Coverida and them. I D Coverida and them, man. Oh, D Sean Bernard. Ex if the, what if the game is in another part of the country, fam? You're not coming. <laughs> I know, bruv. Uber and that. We talking about uh, Uber pulled away. Uber pull up there, bruv. Think it's craving questions. No, bro. The game is booked in Dubai. <laughs> You're not coming. <laughs> nah, I'm not having it now. Nah, Uber pool will come there and we'll match. You see what Aussie men did? You see why we do why we doing it? You see what Aussie men did in Afcon? Bro, all I'm saying is you get there and what colors the Dubai. Kid? We'll fly to the bruv. Right. Think we got a couple players in Saudi. Quick flight over. We're good. But what about the shorts though? Because you can't play in Traxi Worms, sir. <laughs> I know this is mad. He not played it. He not played it. Tricksy buttons. No, that's how I would have. No, he ain't being us. Hey, <laughs> what I'm saying. Let me bring it back though, because that's rude. Because nah, them lot were trying to take liberties, bro. Are you all right? Sorry, man. Sorry, bro. Sorry. I man. wasn't even ready for that. Nigerian, you see, the bell, like, the bell I didn't even rang, and then I got a light hook. I thought we were touching gloves, and then man just came with a right hook. What's this about? Now, you know, it is, yeah, because I was on the show with Don Robbie and X, and they were telling me that they're gonna beat us this, that, the other. And I was thinking, raw, like, this is mad, you know. 
So I'll just sit there. No, like, our squad, our squad, our squad, the, the, bro, you, our squad's actually decent, but you know what third world countries are like when they get a bit of money from uh, FA, no, FIFA. Bro, this is not, we can't even call Nigeria. No, bro, Jamaica, I'm, world, bro, bro, I'm Jamaican. I can say it, bro. You know, bro, they're not third world, bro. Do you know if I'm getting on holiday, bro, but, I'm go Jamaica, bro? <laughs> Who's going yeah, there? But, third world thing. <laughs> But you, but the thing is, you see what them man do when they get a little bit of extra piece that they shouldn't be having. Yeah, yeah. that's not funneling its way down. Even when I left the country, I went to Jamaica, yeah, and they tried to make me pay to leave and enter. But the woman, bro, it's a hustle. The hustle's a hustle, you know. Man said, "Ah, <laughs> oh, the shops over there, hundred dollar, hundred dollar." <laughs> Should I have paid that money though? Because I don't know. <laughs> I meant to. That one? You to leave though, they said I have to pay some tax thing, and I was like, Ah, oh, this don't feel right. <laughs> and you know, when you're like, I don't know, so the, the person like, I'm just gonna pay it to make sure because I don't want to be stranded, but this feels like I'm getting fleeced a little yeah, yeah. bit. Here. I got fleeced because she put the money under the till, and I thought, mm, that's, <laughs> that's shopping. All right, make cool. one more Chanel bag today, you know. All right, cool. Let me let me let, let's keep it moving though. Finally, you're the you're gonna be one of our last co you're, you're the last person I'm talking to today. Yeah. Um we've spoken about a lot of things. Yeah. I just yeah. need to uh McTominay, new contract. Maybe. What it depends if we don't get good peace for him. That's the thing. I'm not taking like 20, 30 mil for McTominay. Because if we're buying a McTominay, how much are they going to charge us for it? Sorry, one second. So McTominay, new contract, you said yes. No, just so we can sell him. So we can sell him, not to keep him, but obviously the new contract ties him in a bit. And then when we sell him, we've got, we're on a stronger footing. Hold on. They want, they want 70 mil for Amadou Onana. Exactly. That's my point. 70 mil for Amadou Onana. We got yeah. Onana at home. <laughs> I hear it. So that's the thing. If we're to to buy a player that replaces McTominay, and that this isn't me rating McTominay and saying he's a, a world be or anything, but we're paying 50, 60 million to replace him. We gotta sell him for a decent man, very wood -wish man like Woodwood-ish right now. I'm a son kind of Woodwoody. <laughs> that that counting needs to account, bro. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. Uh, oh, another question. Another question. Man the saying. And they're saying right now, um, Amadou is not worth that though. That's taking the piss. Um, and we got a nana at home for real. Let me ask you quickly because they're saying Greenwood 50 million. No, nope. yeah, sell him, sell him, sell him. Sorry, I thought you were gonna say stay. He can go. I don't care what the price is. I've already said it. You've simped me because I've said some mad things about where he should be playing, what teams, yeah. prison FC, and that. Um, right. yeah, he can go. All right, but let me let me ask you now. Let me yep. be honest with me, yeah. So I'll be honest you, with you. Bro. We played Liverpool. We played Arsenal preseason. The in Colombia. In Colombia, the bid hasn't gone through for Mason, but he's mm -hmm. played games, scored yeah. in both. What are you doing? I'm not. Uh, this is one thing. No flip flopping in this one. I don't want him in my team, bro. <laughs> I don't want him in the team. And I managed. Go, go, and go, it's go. not a football. It's not a footballing thing. It's not oh, a footballing thing. No selling. I just want to hear you say the words that you. There's no change. I'm saying we played because we're gonna play Arsenal. We're playing Liverpool in preseason. Scores in both of them. Still, still don't want him near the team. Yeah, no he's no real one. That's the that's the one that's not gonna be. That's proper. That's that's because when, when when people make it a footballing discussion, he was a bad boy on the pitch. I can't take that away from him. Generational yeah. talent on the pitch, but it's the yeah. off the pitch business move, man. I think, like, if you say comparing football abilities, he's cold, but compare what he's done on the pitch, audios and that move, man. Courts said, I keep the same energy. He said nothing, courts. I respect that. I respect that because I, I have to keep that energy. Some people will feel differently. If some people, if they're seeing top bins. If they're seeing top bins and couple new, a couple articles, yeah, no, they get twist easy. But no, nah, man, I'm standing, okay. I'm standing my ground on this one. Um, you're standing firm. I respect that. Um, yeah, MG's done. Still, I'm 50-50 with Greenwood. 
put your legs up taxes just <laughs> to hear me um um he's a bad boy in the pitch he's also a bad boy off the pitch <laughs> all right look see joe blackman is joe blackman's buckling under the pressure bro anyway oh, so- no, joe, don't do it. yeah joe and joe was one of the strongest one of the strongest in this um i don't want him at the club anymore the light like comps hit people different, though. The comps we hear people different, man. My thing is that instrumental I... hits, and then people are going, "Oh, maybe." <laughs> oh my god! My thing here is, I just hope they sell him just before we get on the plane, bro. Because I don't know, we, I don't know. We need if strong enough to see, you know, the rondos and that. I don't even know. <laughs> I don't know. When it, Fans when move I... mad as well. Yeah, Pav is Pav's out of this world with it for all. Pav, the fans like the fans, we, like you're saying that's true. All you'll take is one, like you know, the drills where they're shooting on goal and there's not even a defender. Uh, People will be like, Oh, yeah, he's back. <laughs> nah. That's what I was saying. I just need to, I needed to go. Oh, wait, I just the read problem. The, uh, go on, I read the madness. I didn't even read, oh, yeah. I didn't even understand what I was saying early, bro. <laughs> nah, that recent text that they said. <laughs> What happened? <laughs> nah, someone got me the hell out of here. Uh, I'm not even gonna read it, but yeah, nah, 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 nah. I, even... <laughs> I might have to check that one back on the the, the, the stream afterwards. Still, <laughs> no cap is just real. It's what wrote, no caps just said in the thingy. That's insane, <laughs> yo. All right, cool. Now, nah, end the show. End the show. <laughs> In the show, go to police. He said, What? <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. He. I, bro, I went I out and I was realize. like, Yay! I didn't even read, bro. I didn't even realize what I was seeing, bro. And then I remember the video, fam. That's in, nah, no cap. Yeah, yeah. Bro. Your our minds are in the gutter. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yo, yo, I just want you to say goodbye, fam. Literally. Um, today's been a wild show, as always. It has been. And I haven't been here to watch the whole thing. I've been in and out. <laughs> Listen, pause. Business. Uh, you know, but you're a big business, no. man. Hey, yeah, okay. hey, re- resume. Fast it's, forward. Oh, they're saying no. They said, what you, go on. Well done, Joe. Um, there's, what do you call it? There's the new one is No Diddy. That's what everyone's saying at the moment. Do you reckon? <laughs> That's crazy. It? It, hey, that one can run, you know. It can run still. I like it because it, it feels more, you know, brings everyone together, and it's yeah, uh, you know, it's gonna be. cultural uh, conversations. Anyway, quickly yeah, yeah. No, just, um, just Talk if you're them. picking a side, and this is not football related, but why not? Go on, go on, if go you're on, picking go on. a side, Kendrick or J Cole, just go, just so we just so I know where everyone's at because I've made my wait. Pick a side. Let's go. Oh, oh, that's easy for me. I'm Kung Fu Kenny all the way. No, I'm Kung Fu Kenny all the way. Been supporting him. I love J Cole. Don't get me wrong, as a as a rapper, but Kung Fu Kenny for me, man. No. Why? 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 Why are you saying no? Not Jermaine. No. Not Jermaine. No. Man, man, Jermaine, Jermaine's a real one, man. I remember. I remember. I randomly saw him on Regent Street one day, and he he was real exactly. cool, man. He's the only one you're gonna see just riding his bike, chilling in the ends, bro. J. Cole, bro. But still, nah, but as a rapper for me, Kung Fu Kenny, bro. That's my that's my G. I and I and I and I rate J. Cole, don't get me wrong. I rate J. Cole as a rapper. Big, oh, big rapper. Man, that's sad. I hate that we're on the wrong side of history with this one. Still big it's up, fun. bro. Big up, man. That's sad. It's fine. I'm a J. Cole fan, man. The warm up, there's too many albums, man. There's T Ken- Kendrick is cold, but he's had some mid as well. Let's not be pimping a butterfly, it was brilliant, but then there's been mid as well. And who who do you pick if you haven't heard of Eva? DB Cooper, um, J. Cole, J. Cole. All right, cool. Let's get out of here. Anyway, you lot stay locked into hip hop beef. It's 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 lit. It's incredible. Everyone have a great day, man. Great, good to be at good health. Do something good for yourself and someone else. Have a nice one. Look after yourself, everybody. I'm out. Jump a bomb, 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 bomb.
back with a vengeance. KG's back with an entrance. Big up to those in attendance. Reds come together like Tetris. No rules, this one's reckless. KG, this one's crazy. You're too reckless. None can compare with the KG Don. Better take cover when he drops that. Going on reckless, trust it's on. It's that time when he drops that. I said drop a bomb, Dad.